Welcome to Dorman Kager, I'm Tanner. I'm Rob. And what are we drinking today, Rob? Today we are drinking Champagne Velvet brand beer from Upland. Because how fancy are we? First of all, love everything about that can art. It looks really fancy. So it is the beer with the million dollar flavor. Funny story. Tell me, tell me a funny story. The reason that this is the beer with the million dollar flavor is not just, what, just, what, what just, do they call it's it? It's just marketing, right? Just marketing fluff. Not marketing fluff. This is actually this beer was actually in in the early days of Upland, which opened in 1902, was uh, insured for a million dollars. That's why they call it. That's true. The beer with a million dollars. Look it up. We did. Although I wouldn't be surprised if you just randomly knew. And oh, ooh, okay, good, good. And it's uh, brewed with Bohemian yeast. I actually don't know what that means, but I'm excited to get in there. I'm guessing that it's uh, Edie Brickell in the new Bohemian. Driving <laughs> it through shallow water before I get too deep. Take a look at that. She's married to Paul Simon. That is, well, you can see my dumb face through it, but that is <laughs> almost crystal clear. <laughs> so you put my face again through it. <laughs> it's see, so my dumb. dumb. My dumb it's so dumb. Very light. Look at the head on that bastard. Almost fruity nose. Oh. Yeah. That's weird. That is a light. If you would have said, hey guys, here's your next uh, cider. Right. Isn't that weird? I don't know how I feel about that. That's a light fruity nose. Let me let this die down a little bit. Especially for a Pilsner. Now, like I said, I what I love about this can art is that it's pure old style smoky tavern. Just smoky tavern. Smoky tavern. We're going to watch the game at, you know... Something like Thornton's, or be surrounded by street entrepreneurs. <laughs> street entrepreneurs and their uh... <laughs> and their guests, <laughs> guests. their special friends. Um, I'm excited. About their, this. their marketing team. <laughs> yeah, their marketing. <laughs> <laughs> their interns. Yes. <laughs> exactly. All right, let's do it. Let's get in there. You ready? With their entrepreneur cane and their feather entrepreneur hat, and they're smacking their interns. and their beautiful entrepreneur. <laughs> Yeah. Fur coats. Yeah. <laughs> right up the nose. <coughs> How does it taste, Tanner? Shit. <laughs> it tastes like shit. Um, so I'm gonna, quit. I'm, I'm gonna take it from here as he's dying. Go get something. Oh, it's coming out of my nose. It is coming out of your nose. Oh my god. God, it's like the last time you and I were in the bedroom together. <laughs> Shut up. So, oh. honestly, this is this is not too bad. It's a little bitter, <laughs> but it's to be expected as a pilsner. Um, I would say. I would say it's pretty pretty good. It definitely reminds me of like a hams or like an old style even. I love how we're just continuing. Like it's this. pretty good. Well, I mean, you didn't die, so. It's like snot and beer all over the table. It's not the first time. Oh, we're back. <laughs> no, we never left. <laughs> all right, hold on. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> nice and easy. Good job. That's how you're supposed to drink a beer. Um, That's nice. The whole process. The first the first drink and then that one. That's mm -hmm. how you're supposed to drink a beer. <laughs> Yeah. No, it's it's a good beer. Like like yeah. I said, it reminds me of like an like an old school beer. It reminds me of like a Hams or like an old style. But and I'm gonna take it a step farther. I feel like if you drink this next to a Hams or an old style, this does pull itself a little away from. No, it. no, man. Hams is pretty. Like, what other beer do, can you drink that tastes the same hot as it does cold? <laughs> if that's your metric, I mean, shouldn't it be? Uh oh. It isn't bad. It isn't bad. Hmm? What? I'm getting a call, but it's not important. Well, hopefully it doesn't interrupt the audio. In no, it won't. Okay. It won't. Well, because it is... My phone doesn't do that, and that's actually the blood bank, and you can't have any more of my blood. All right. <clears throat> no, Boys, we, just, we just get that sweet, sweet plasma money. Sweet, sweet plasma money. It's sweet plasma. So sweet. The plasma um, is the, it's really the way to go when you want to get money. This has very, been a very interesting video. I've died. Um, I've got a phone call. Um, we were talking about we talked about plasma money. Plasma money. A street entrepreneurs. I've shot um, champagne velvet out of my nose, which was we've compared it to hams, which is something quite that un, I never thought we quite would. Quite uncomfortable, but I give it a two point five. I give it a three. Uh -huh. uh, you know how I feel about like older trailer beers and stuff like that. I could crush a thirty pack of hams. 
Yeah. I, I would say, like, if you could find this in a 30-pack, I feel like it'd be in that. I'd drink this over hands or old style. Yeah, but you're not going to get this in a 30-pack for 10 bucks. Yeah, this is fair. This is fair. Um, it's it's nice the like that it tastes that way, and you can buy a more expensive beer that tastes like trailer beer. I like the concept; it's very hipster esque, like the fanciest trailer beer you've ever had. Right? Yeah. But at the same time, I you know if I want trailer beer, I'm gonna pay ten, twelve bucks for a thirty rack of Hams or Old Style, and I'm not going to look back. Fair enough. So, but what you can do is like, subscribe, hit that little bell at the bottom, follow us on Instagram, Facebook for all sorts of drummer cake shenanigans. Don't do that. Cause that's I, like, I blew it that way. Yeah, okay, that's very respectful of you. If you are looking to support well, the craziness. For a fellow, fellow street entrepreneur, I'm going to make sure I don't blow things in your face. <laughs> street entrepreneurs are going to street entrepreneur. Uh, <laughs> but check out our Patreon link below. Got street. I mean, because obviously through this video, you've noticed A, super professional, B, we have a lot of fun. C, we don't normally shoot beer out of our nose. In Q, we are awesome. Super awesome. I love how we jump right down to Q. Check That's my... not the next one? Oh, buddy. We'll talk about it. We're working on him. He's I'm getting... just a chef, okay? He's getting his education. Um, <laughs> Am I? <laughs> I do budget booze reviews. He does wildly cheap wine reviews. Dom does amazing cigar um, reviews. And we do... <laughs> cigar... Um... I'm sorry. What, what did I say three times in a row <laughs> already? Shaving velvet like, in my frontal cortex right now. <laughs> Physically and mentally. But he is, he is drunk as can be. No. Because it went straight through that. I was going to say. Blood brain blood. barrier. <laughs> yeah, right? It crossed right over. See, I know words. Yeah. So, I just don't know the alphabet. Till next or time. Or how to count to 15. Don't drink your beer like I do. You know what? You, you can drink your beer however you want. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Oh. It's like, it's like in my eyes.